So all these things, what you see pretty much behind me, the lake and up on the hill, it's the whole thing is the property of my girlfriend's family. Uh, and they use this area for a cemetery. It is their cemetery. It's a graveyard for her family and her family's ancestors. And they come here usually after every Thanksgiving when the family gathers, they walk up to say hello to the deceased. It's a beautiful place. It's a totally different concept of cemetery as in the Western culture. It's much more spiritual. I have to practice. Today is a special day. Today is the Korean version of Thanksgiving and they call it Chusa. And each family, the whole family gathers at the oldest person within that family. And in this case, it's Jian's grandmother and grandfather. Danas je dan zahvalnosti u Koreji. Oni to zovu Chusa. I čitava familia se okuplja kod najstarijih u toj porodici. This table, the meal here, it goes to the ghost mm -hmm. that protects this family. Yeah. And this? Yes, sir. Here? Yeah. And the fish has to go east? Fish has to go east. So the head of the fish has to face east. So this is for the ghost that protects the family. So this table, this goes separately, and this is for people who don't have a family, mm -hmm. right here? Yeah, like there. So we just leave it here? Yeah, we leave it here. Take this. Okay, Mr. Corning. Which table? Big table. The main table. This smells so good. my style and this is made from a very special earth right yeah. that is good for your skin it's antibacterial yeah i'm gonna sleep good tonight right so yeah. or not right so oh hello hello Dan zahvalnosti u Koreji se zove Chusa i to je sutra. I tu sam kod devojkini uh, babe i dede, najstariji deo porodice. I tu slavimo um, dan zahvalnosti. I'm talking about Serbian. And, ali ovo, ovako mi izgleda sobica da ću ja da prespavam, prenoćim. Uh, što su mi rekli je da je ovaj zid napravljen od specijalnog materijala od neke zemlje koji ima jako puno dobrih efekata. Here. 
so for the every thanksgiving in the morning the the family also puts like a meal at the top of the gate the entrance to their house and that that meal is dedicated for everyone who doesn't have a house and also for all those people who are not related to this family so they cannot come in and spend thanksgiving here so that meal is placed for them mm -hmm. so before eating the family members of this given family mm -hmm. they get together and they bow for the honor and the memory of the ancestors right yeah Why do you have to bow twice? Who's on the two ones? Dead man twice. Live live man one. If somebody is alive, alive, we just bow just once. If somebody we bow to person who are like dead, we bow, we bow twice. It's my grandfather's brother, younger brother. Grandfather's younger brother. Yeah, grandfather's younger brother.